is going on guys this is Dylan from GamingConsoles.com and today I'm going to show you how you can easily connect an Xbox One S controller Bluetooth with a MacBook so let's get right to it now the first step is you want to simply sync your Xbox One controller and have it ready to sync. You can easily do this by pressing the sync button here. So let me just get the autofocus good. As you can see here, this button here, just hold it down for a bit and your Xbox will start blinking, which is indicating that it's on sync mode, ready to pair up. And then you simply go to your MacBook. It is extremely easy to connect your Xbox One S controller. Now, all you have to do is you have to go to your navigation, type Bluetooth, boom click on Bluetooth and you will see your Xbox wireless controller under the devices assuming it's in sync mode if you follow the steps previous all you have to do is click on connect and then boom your Xbox one wireless controller will be connected easy as pie so as you can see here my Xbox one controller is completely connected to my PC and I'm playing Super Mario World on retrogames.cc this is a website where you can work, where you can play tons and tons of emulate games completely for free and easily with the xbox controller as you can see here i'm not controlling the keyboard and i'm moving mario easily now one way you configure it is you go to where you can see where is it sorry controller settings and you have all your buttons here where you can click on let's say for example you're doing player four one sec as you see here so if i want to go and play a four boom you can see this one says, says immediately this one says connected gamepad xbox wireless xbox controller stand to gamepad blah 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 so this is already set up but if you got you wanted to set up yourself you simply go to player two you simply select one of these actions so for example up down left or right you click on set bar and then you would press the corresponding action on your Xbox controller. So if you want X to be up or, you know, these, uh, these up and down analog stick to mean up and down or whatever on the game, you simply do that very easily and very simply. So why would you want to use an Xbox One S controller with your computer? Well, personally, I'm not a very big fan of mouse and keyboard, and I think a traditional controller is just a lot more effective in certain games, especially racing games. And this easily allows you to play, you know, tons of emulator games, PS2 emulator, PS3 emulator, Xbox 360 emulator. You know, there's tons and tons and tons and tons of games you can play via your computer that in my opinion are just a lot more effective and a lot more interesting with an Xbox controller or a PS4 controller. You know, the same thing why I said today can easily be done with a PS4 controller as well. So that's it. I hope you really enjoyed the video and I'm busy playing with your Xbox One controller and your PC. Please like and subscribe to help your boy out and I'll speak to you soon. Goodbye.